You brought this on, Ben. You're making this easier and easier for me, you, you freak. Oh, it's so easy to cast accusations, isn't it, Phil? But we're here because of things that all of us have done. We're here because you're a bunny boiling nut job who pretends to be a scared some mouse, but really you go around torturing little children. You just don't get it at all, do you? I thought you were my saviour. You know, after my husband and my parents, I thought you loved me for me. I was marrying you. What more did you want, eh? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Go and buy your own engagement ring, Stella. Don't bother changing your holiday plans, Grant. Talk about phoning it in. Love is about making someone feel free. I thought you were the person to do that, and I gave you my heart, and you, you took it, and you just put your feet up on it. Don't try and turn this on me. If you'd have loved me, if you'd have liked me, I might have felt a bit of confidence, you know, come out of myself. But you, you, you held it all back. You wouldn't even kiss me in public sometimes. Oh, what, and that justifies what you did, does it? Hey, Telling my son that you'd kill him in his bed if he didn't keep his mouth shut, <laughs> hey? I didn't mean... No? So what did you mean? I was panicking. You just don't know how hard these last few weeks have been, Phil. It's been such a struggle, you know, trying to get you up the aisle. I was so nearly there, and then Ben, you... Yeah, Ben. Ben said, please stop abusing me, didn't he? I wasn't abusing him. It wasn't like that. It's about trying to feel that I'm here. What the hell are you on about, eh? Well, ever since my sister died... Oh, here we go. No one cares about your sister, Stella. Well, you should care about my sister because she's the reason I am the way I am. So what, oh. hey? Do you know what it feels like to be nothing, Phil? To be talked over at mealtimes, to be discussed like your pet dog during the holidays or where should we leave her this week? You start to feel like you're not there, like you're a ghost in your own life. And the only way I could remind myself that I was there was to pinch myself, you know, like how you do in a dream. You should have got help. I didn't think I need help, Phil. Not once I got a life of my own. I, I thought I'd be seen again. I'd be a person. That's all I wanted, Phil. It's your fault as much as mine. <laughs> Phil. What are you doing? I'm making you listen. To what? To me. Tell me you love me, Phil. <laughs> but only for a minute, and I'll give you the satisfaction of putting your hands around my neck. You ain't dragging me into your sick games. You know, I ain't an 11 year old boy you can bully. I'm not a bully. Nah. You're right. You. You're nothing. Please. It's true. You know, I, I chose you because you were easy. I chose you because you were safe. I thought you'd look after Ben, eye me shirts and keep your mouth shut for the next 30 years. You see, I was right. So what? You know, I didn't love you because I didn't love you. That's between me and you. You don't go bullying kids because you don't get your own way. There's a long way down. You ain't gonna do it. Watch me, Daddy. <laughs> 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 